right guys welcome to today's video there's something on the screen i don't know if it's the screen or if it's the lens but anyways welcome back to today it is late in the day it's after two what time is it sam i didn't think you was. i was not it's three. It's after three. The girls are dressed for winter because that's what we do on the day-by-day day time. It's 3.03. 3.03. So have you washed your face yet today? No. You better go do that. We're headed out to do a little bit of back to school stuff. You guys know we've been getting ready for school. That's what I've been doing all morning. We have moved the baby chicks out of the living room to our little shed area. So we have our little brooder back in action. Have you been moving this thing over? Yeah, because I keep on... She's got a cup on her head, it looks like. Because every time I come out here, I fix this, and then it's, like, moved over again. It's so confusing. But anyways, welcome to today. Welcome from our baby chicks. <laughs> Look at that little one. That little one was one so one. cute. It is literally raining outside, and my hair always goes crazy when it rains. I have a story to tell you guys about the horses. <sighs> I'll tell you when we get in the car. We're ready? We're all ready? Oh, you guys should see that when the kids were here, they were playing with this little kitchen. I love this little kitchen. It's just so cute. I don't like it in the middle of the living room. But anyways, when they left, they left it all set up. And I thought it was just so cute. Like, anybody could just arrive at any point and have this smorgasbord of beautiful food ready for them. It's just adorable. Before I forget, everybody wants to know, or if they probably want to know, how are you doing, Sam? Better. Are you actually better? Hard to walk still, but I'm doing better. It is a pouring rain. So basically, the horses were out this morning all together. You guys know that Chino being here has brought our mares into heat already for the second time. There was the fiasco the other day of Willow and Chino. Well, now he is making the rounds. He's making the rounds, you guys. So I sent the girls outside this morning to put the horses away. Ooh, car. Send them out. And so we left them in the, we left them on the field a lot longer today. I noticed that they're just starting, I noticed the field is starting to be finished with grass and we can either um, fence off another area so they can eat like this, the other stuff that's growing or we can, yeah, I think that's a good idea because they're like starting to be done. I know a lot of our friends, their grass has already run out for the year because of the weather, not enough rain. Yeah, so if we make another pen and fence off a whole new area where the horses can graze on like nice fresh grass, hay, then um, they can eat like till the first snow probably. Like our little property is a happening little property. We have enough food for all of our horses for like a long time. But anyways, so I sent the girls out to put the horses away and I'm watching out the window because I always feel like I was getting dressed and I was I always feel a little nervous when they go out there by themselves to deal with four horses, especially hormonal horses. So they go outside and I'm watching and Penny and Chino are in the field and they are neck and neck, rubbing their necks and squealing Not and when I was outside. Oh my gosh, I was watching. When I was outside, they were far away from each other, so I don't know. So, yeah, let me get to the rest of the story. So, they're like rubbing each other, and she knows like into it. Sophie says she doesn't like Penny, but from what I could see, he likes Penny. So, anyways, out of nowhere, Gracie just comes over and she's like, get away from my mare, and she runs Chino off. So Chino runs to the shelter, and then Penny's running behind them, squirting pee out behind her the whole entire way, and she's like, stay away from my boyfriend. And then from far away comes Willow and she's running. They're all just like trotting around the field, but Willow's got her little legs on and you know how she looks like when she means business and she just trots away and she trots all up to them and they're all in the shelter. And then Gracie pushes Chino out of the shelter and they're all like involved in this whole, I don't even know what you call it, but <laughs> they're all involved in this whole mating ritual and seeing who's gonna win and and then all of a sudden the girls come out the door. The horses are all looking at each other, all trying to figure out who's gonna win who. And the girls go out the door and they slam it. And all the horses instantly jerk their head up and they all stare at the house. And I was just laughing so hard because they stopped dead, you guys. Stopped dead when they heard the girls. And then Chino walked right up to that fence like, oh, 
these girls they're trying to like corrupt me like Gabby look at what I've been dealing with and then Gabby starts walking down to where she takes him out of the field and he just starts walking right down <laughs> to where he gets out of the field and then there's a whole train of girls following him and Penny squirting pee the whole entire time tail right up and I'm like you know we are really putting on a show for our neighbors we're really putting on a show for our neighbors like holy heck if it's not one thing it's another but honestly I'm so happy having him home like I always feel so much better when all of our horses are under our roof this need to have all of our horses under one roof but anyway welcome to today uh, we're headed to the mall to do some more back to school shopping because it's bumpy because um, it's almost school time you guys it's almost school and we are not ready yet I've been cleaning all morning trying to get ready and hopefully we will be ready because we have less than a week. Do we have a week? We have a week. We have a week. Wow. Do you guys see what I mean? Sam's going to fix it so it's even more dramatic. But all the water, when it pools, it just pools in this one little area. He has it on a hill. It has been out there. It has been raining. Everything is wet and yucky, but it's cooled down a lot. Everything is wet, you guys. Like, even the halters are wet. That's awful. Aww, that's the cutest thing. I'll show you guys. But anyways, Sophie got new Crocs. I know that some people don't like Crocs because they don't cover her heels. But they are very protective other than the heels because they're really thick plastic. They're better than sneakers. Well, I'm very proud of you guys for not rolling in the mud. Anyways, I just wanted to show you guys. Oh, he ran off. He ran off. There he is. <laughs> he's back. I'll see you. Make sure you have food in your bowl. Okay. Oh, he's so cute. You're so cute. And it's time to take the girls out and the boys out for their nightly rendition of who will win the boy. Yeah, she just peed. Thank goodness I wasn't standing behind her. Right there, too. Yeah, she's on the roll. On the... She's on the prowl. Look at that tail. <laughs> that is embarrassing. Our horses are embarrassing us, you guys. Honestly. They just want to be left alone. I think if they're left alone, yeah, everything would be fine. It's just that Willow is in the heat now, so she couldn't care less. Gracie hasn't come into heat yet. Tail still flying high. <laughs> oh my gosh. But the thing is, is that they do settle down and go off and eat. It just like, they just do this stuff for a while and then, oh my gosh, we might have to separate them again because I do not like this. This is how the, somebody gets hurt. Penny. Uh-oh. And see, that's what happens. He starts to try and be with Penny and then the other horses come and chase him off and it's all good. Now he'll go and eat and leave them alone. <laughs> and it's over for the day so Sophie wants to show you guys that she got gibbets little things that go on there you can get we got ramen a cactus a fish I think it's a rainbow trout or something and a flower see everything's cool in the yard now unfortunately Chino tried to mount Penny's head so either his dad didn't give him a good talking to <laughs> or he's confused just want to make sure the kitty has food. Sam must have fed him already. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys some of the things that we got today. We did like a, a bit of a school haul. I are sure to go for the Yeah. I ordered a bunch of stuff, two big orders online and they haven't come in yet, but we're going to make a video and show you our back to school stuff. One thing that always happens when we go shopping is that the dog runs around like a crazy thing. <laughs> Okay, you want your hug? Basically what always happens is that uh, Sophie always finds a lot of things to buy and Gabby always finds a few things to buy. So uh, Sophie, Gabby got some socks. We got some pens. So I think these are Gabby's. We got some glue. Oh, yes, Gabby, one of those Do you guys know I couldn't find pencils these anywhere? Both are mine. Yeah, so those are good. yours. What pens do I get? We got some rulers. Yeah, I get those. Oh, you got that? Yeah, yeah I, that's mine. And then I got found this one. We couldn't find pencil cases anywhere. It's cute, Gabby. It feels good. Do you want you want this? this? Is mine. Gabby got that kind of a pencil holder. Like when you homeschool, you can use anything. But I thought this after she left the store. It's a pencil holder. Yeah, but feel this. This feels nice. 
No. Mm. All right. Well, anyways, do you want it? We couldn't find pencils anywhere. I did end up finding some. We got glue sticks. Yeah, I got two of those. Okay, so I got packing. I got scissors. Them. Actually, Gabby, yeah, you didn't get scissors. She ran off. I basically okay. got two can, of everything. Can I set everything up? Yeah, you can go ahead and set everything up. But let's show them what you got at the mall. I like setting things up. I know, but let's show them what you got at the mall first. Um, these pens. I got these pens for you. You got the bad kind. Oh, well. You didn't come in. These are the good kind. Gabby picked these. Gabby came in and picked them, and you didn't come in, Look so I picked those. These are. Yeah, they are so super cute. How well do they cut? Good. I also got paper. We do a lot of printing. I also got carrots for the horses. Oh, oh it's so cute, Gabby. Yeah. These are Gabby's pens. Yeah. I've heard so much about this pink stuff, cleaning stuff. Have you guys heard about it? I heard it, I've seen it on YouTube, like other that. family channels even. And they say it's like the best cleaner that you can get. Yeah, and it's all natural. Want. Anyway, so I got that. The kids always make me go into showcase, the showcase really store, and I got that. And we got erasers. <laughs> All right, so let's go show them what oh, we I'll bought. Call three. <laughs> just no, one just one. One ruler each. Yeah. I take everything apart, organize it, take everything apart, organize it. Yeah, that is the fun part of school. Back to school is getting all your like supplies and. Okay. It was not as fun this year because there it were. It was so fun. Oh, but there was no stuff. Like I couldn't find well, all the stuff I, I wanted. I like organizing things and I love shopping even more. So like. It's okay. Well, I have a uh, Amazon order coming any day with like all of our craft stuff that we're going to be doing this season this season term i got new bright orange crocs you cannot <laughs> chew them, you chew them i see them up the there high up because crocs are like 80 dollars in canada and that will be the end of you, if you and she them. already chewed sophie's last yeah, pair and i love those ones yeah i love them too and, and she... if you touch anything of mine that will be the end of you. <laughs> that will be the end of you. She loves chewing stuff. All right. My old pencil case is chewed, obviously. Some of my life is chewed. Yeah, she's a little bit of a chewer, and it is a, definitely our fault. But okay. she's obsessed with chewing. Yeah. And we have a bucket of toys. Yeah. No, all every toy I pick out, she does not like. Every toy Gabby picks out for her dog, she loves. Okay. It's, it's mean. She's she like, what did you buy me? I know. Every time we go someplace, this dog is like, I want to see what I can do. Well, what can I have? It's because I kind of spoil her and get her a bunch of toys for Christmas and stuff. Excuse me. All right. Girls are going to show you what they bought. And remember what I said. Gabby, Sophie always chooses a ton of things. And Sophie, or Sophie always chooses a ton of things. Mm -hmm. Gabby never chooses a lot. But whenever she needs something, she always like, she always knows what she wants. Okay. So she gets it later. So she got, got this. Pink sweater. Yeah. From Air American Eagle. Oh, Amer from American Eagle. You should I don't want to see Costco. No. Okay. I love Sophie in pink. And then I got a blue sweater from American Eagle. Super cute. Uh, so uh, she actually needs to get more pants, but it was a sweater kind of day. It was dark and dreary and cool out. I got this from I don't know what store. Um, from, oh, I forget. Blue Notes. Blue Notes. So this one is a store in our mall. She got New York City Athletics. So two blues and a pink. This from also from Blue Notes. And then she got a navy, or then she got a hunter green one from Blue Notes as well. And on the back it says North. Northwestern. North Africa. Oh, yeah, Alright, Gabby, come show them what you got. Is that it? Yeah. So Sophie, Gabby got socks and she got... I got SpongeBob. She got SpongeBob. You all know it's cool. So she got a sweater last week and it shrunk in the wash. Everything and... shrinks when you wash it. Yeah, when I wash it. So anyway, she likes them to be big. Which is new this year. And she got a Northwestern shirt too and it's black with purple. Yeah, that's super cute. But anyway, that's all she got. She got just two sweaters. Back to school shopping is fun, except for when you actually have to do the part of going to school. Yeah. Sophie just kept reminding me, you know that back to school, the first week is easy, right? The first week, the first week is easy. We have the pencils. We have the pens. We have... 
the warm cozy sweaters that you need in Canada in fall and then we have their curriculum that is not here yet and hopefully it'll be here soon I ordered an entire year worth of curriculum for the whole entire year usually I like try and do it per term to figure out what we what we like and what we want to do this year I just ordered the whole entire kit um, hopefully that will come before school starts because <laughs> we kind of need it oh, but if it doesn't okay. that's okay I know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna put my pens and pencils in here or maybe just pencils in here and then like the this and this and this yeah. So we are getting ready for school. The horses are out there <laughs> embarrassing us. And while well, people drive by and watch them, I can just imagine all the little kids like, look, mommy, a horse. <laughs> and then the mom being like, close your eyes. <laughs> um, but things are getting back to normal. We'll be back at riding lessons today. And while you're watching this, we'll be back at lessons. And we're getting ready for a whole new season, you guys. It is fall. It is almost fall here on the Day by Day Farm. And hopefully by the end of this week, or by the end, by the time school goes back in, we'll have a new truck. And we will be on our trail ride adventure for fall, which is my favorite time to trail ride. Anyway, that is it for today's video. And we will see you guys tomorrow. Don't you know that you're beautiful? Just the